Hey guys, what's up? It's Exuperist here, and today I'll be reacting to episode 1 of Fruits Basket 2019. Now, I was trying to decide whether to do a reaction to the 2019 version versus the 2001 version, and after reading a few comments online, I decided on going for the 2019 version because it's apparently more accurate to the source material, and they changed a few things in the 2001 version. So, also, the art style is going to be a lot more, a lot different a lot more modern in the 2019 version and so that's why i decided to go with 2019. anyway so this is episode one of fruits basket 2019 and without further ado let's get on with it okay guys before we continue with the reaction don't forget to hit like and subscribe and click on the notification bell so that you won't miss any new uploads and with that let's go back to the reaction Okay, so we have the Zodiac <laughs> sitting in a circle. This is a little bit more mystical than I thought it was going to be. Okay, tell me, is this... Is this in reference to some kind of legend? Okay. That's not really a good foreshadowing, is it? When someone is crying at the first frame. Okay. Right off the bat, we have a few very despondent elements to this to this anime. Her mother's dead, and we have a crying creature, kind of like a cat crying in the first scene. I'm not sure if this is a good sign. <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> Do I need to prepare myself emotionally for this? Oh, wait a minute. So that tent is kind of like the shrine that they put up for her mom? Oh, this isn't her house. It's a weird, weird way of saying it. Okay. So, okay, so it is, so that whole thing is a folk tale. It's kind of like a legend from a long time, from a long time ago. And I'm guessing that's going to be the format that we're going to use for this whole story, right? Okay, so it's basically the same story of the Zodiac, but it's just... It's just that, there, it's just that there's a cat. <laughs><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> I see. That's just his cousin? I thought that was his father. Mm. Okay, this is base this is similar to what's happening in Kimini Tadoke. 
But I guess there's, there's always that. <laughs> okay, who are these people now? <laughs> are they are they her friends? Oh, okay. <laughs> right, he is beautiful. Not not just handsome. He's very beautiful. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's really funny. <laughs> they're done. Well, they're done. <laughs> wow. Ooh. Okay, so I got her situation now. She's living alone? Oh, uh, wait. No, she's not yet living alone. But she... Her mother has died. But maybe her father is working. Mm. Oh, her grandparents. Wait, so she was living in that tent? What's happening with her family situation? Seriously. Okay, this is a bit dark. <laughs> Right off the bat, I think it's very dark, deep, and serious. Uh-huh。その後、引用語業や創生総括が取り入れられて、うん、オッケー。ああ。猫が中日に加わる好きなんて初めからなかったんだよ。All right. I don't know anything about the Zodiac or about fortune telling, so I don't know. No, that's not what he's saying, girl. It's something else completely different. But I, I, I'm not familiar with that, with that whole thing, so I can't really say anything about it. But he does look a lot more profound than he he seems to be. Okay, what is with this guy and their family and their zodiac knickknacks? <laughs> I don't know yet, but it's it's intriguing to say the least. Wait, both her parents are dead. And now she's living with her grand her father's parents. And then apparently her paternal grandparents are abusing her? Well also die from an accident. Okay, this is just way too much. Wait. He doesn't seem... Okay, he, he, he seems like a nice guy. Very unassuming. Uh -huh. But So that's why she's been living out in a tent uh -huh. And so that's why she decided to just live out in a tent Outside. 
<笑>ワオ。毎日夕食が出前か外食だと飽きちゃうな。じゃあ仕事ば食事作ってよ。作ったって文句言うじゃないか君は。カレーの中にたくあんが入ってれば文句の一つも言いたくなるよ。ゆ
Rats. Rats? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so they can control the, the Zodiac animals, probably? I don't know. Who is that? Wait, okay, so we have another... A childhood friend, probably, that we don't know about yet. So, the, the, the cap, her mother... まさか。でもどうやって秘密。うん、オッケー。じゃあ、荷物上に運んじゃうね。汚い家だけど、ちょうど2階に部屋が空いてるし、改築が終わるまでこの家に泊まればいいよ。<laughs> he's gonna just take advantage of her. That's that's the the kind of life I want to live, yo. <laughs> Just be you and live at your own pace. That's the kind of life that I want. <laughs> I mean, you can do it despite what other what other rules or social norms or customs there are, but you know, you know. There might be consequences if you actually do it. Mm. The heck is that? ねえ、俺をちょっと前まで<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> <laughs> wait a minute. It's very interesting. Wait, wait, wait. What's going on? That was very interesting, very fascinating first episode. The, the music's really good, by the way. It almost got me there a little bit when she was talking about her history, her story. Uh, I mean, her backstory with her mom and her dad both dying. And now she's living with her grandfather, but because they're doing renovations at their house, she can't really live anywhere else. So now she's been living in a tent outside in the in the out basically doing doing a lot of outdoorsy stuff on her own in the territory of the Soma clan I think. Uh and so just one thing led to another and now she's living with uh the prince of the school and his cousin 
and some other guy. I, I don't know. I think they're all related, probably. Uh, they all can turn into animals. This is very interesting. I mean, it's a, it's a lot of things rolled into one. There's magic, romance, mystery. There's action. And just a little bit of comedy here and there. So, wow. Okay. This is very interesting. It's, it was very sad uh, when they introduced all of this dark, gloomy, you know, heavy stuff. But it does have its lighthearted moments. And I do hope that uh, it can, it can, you know, bring that to it, to its rightful conclusion. Because it's being, it's trying to tug at my heartstrings, but not, it's not enough yet. <laughs> I'm not gonna cry the first episode. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, that was a really cool episode. Uh, I liked it. I, I liked it. it. It's a, it's a nice intro, introduction to, to the anime, to the story. And I'm very excited to see what happens in the next one we get to probably have a little bit more information about this family or these people i don't know who they are i don't know why they can turn into animals it's probably has something to do with a zodiac folktale and yeah it's supposed to be romance but and drama but it's i guess it's more than that yeah so i loved i loved it i loved it i loved it so yeah, thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one. Thank you guys for watching until the end of this video. Click here to subscribe and check out these two videos for more fun content. See you in the next one.